what's up welcome back to my channel so today I want to do something a little bit different um, I know there's a few different things my hair is different from one I French braided it last night when I went to sleep because I don't I don't know why I just felt like having really crazy weird curly hair so this is what we ended up with but I was sent now before I go through with this I want to say I am well aware that so I know that I have taken my personal makeup and what I want from my makeup cruelty free I want to make that very clear that does not mean that I'm not going to like if I'm sent something to try I'm not going to not try it because it goes against what I believe and what I want from my makeup that being said I was sent the Maybelline color sensational made for all lip color now this is between this is for buzz agent um This, I'll go ahead and just read this sheet to you. Welcome to the Maybelline Color Sensational Made for All Lip Color Buzz Campaign. Review the information below for instructions on how to participate in this campaign. Simply post the required hashtags and we'll be able to locate your post. Easy peasy. Campaign requirements. Deadline. Post by Monday, February 18th. Um, you can post on Instagram and Facebook. At minimum, an Instagram or Facebook post is required for campaign credit. Post inspiration. Let's start off the new year with a bang, shall we? You'll feel fabulous wearing new Maybelline Color Sensational Made for All Lip Color, knowing it's been tested on 50 skin tones. Post a sensational selfie on Instagram to let followers know about the seven, there's seven shades, made for all uh, av available at Walgreens share your Facebook blah 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 let people know you are wearing ruby for me this is the shade ruby for me I have not used it I have not swatched it uh, clearly it got damaged during shipping I literally just opened the box and suck it on my desk um so hashtag and mentions your campaign your post captions must include walgreens sponsored made for all and tag maybelline and walgreens do not include any profanity nudity inappropriate behavior in your post do not display tag or mention other brands retailers including cvs Rite aid target in your image um, do not post a photo of your buzz kit box or this welcome letter. Do ensure that Maybelline is the main focal point and do make your post authentic. Okay. So I was sent this, that letter, and a few coupons for $2 off. Maybelline, any Maybelline lip product. Now, we all know I am a sucker for a good red lipstick. I currently have on some Steve Laurent lip oil. I'm going to take that off. And we are going to give an honest review about this. Now, I know I said I'm not going to do this. Um, I'm not going to purchase these items that aren't cruelty free. However, if something comes out and I'm like, oh my God, I really want to try this and maybe find a cruelty free, free dupe, I won't lie, I will do that. So we're going to go ahead and try this. That was a weird taste. Hmm. 
Okay, this wasn't my best lipstick application. I really don't even use lipsticks anymore. I really reach for like liquid lipsticks. Okay, this is the shade. It's pretty. <laughs> it really reminds me of Ruby Woo. Anyone else? Getting that Ruby Woo vibe. Maybe it's, it's might be like a smidge darker than a Ruby Woo. But it really like reminds me of Ruby Woo. Okay. So. I have no lip liner on. We're going to do a test. And I'll wear this and I'll come back um, in a few hours and give an updated post but I will say it's creamy it has like a weird sweet smell to it but not like a intentionally fragrance that way sweet smell okay definitely not transfer proof which most actual lipsticks aren't so I'm not surprised by that but I'm gonna go ahead and wear this for a few hours and then I'll check back in with you Okay, so I'm about to take my makeup off. Um, I've eaten, I've drinking, drunk, drank. I don't know. I've been sipping on coffee, water, iced tea. Um, it's faded quite a bit, but at the same time, it's also like stained. Is it my favorite drugstore product? No. Is the pigment good? Yes. Is it drying? No. Because it never really dries down. And it stains like really bad. Um, overall, I rather reach for like heart or if I'm going drugstore I'd rather reach for NYX because I know it's gonna last longer I know it's not gonna transfer everywhere is this something I'm like ooh I want to stop buying cruelty free makeup so I can wear no do I know for a fact if it works on all would they say 50 Don't know for a fact if it works on all 50 skin tones. No. Did it work for mine? It was a very flattering lipstick for my particular skin tone. Um, I actually might give this to my mom. If my mom doesn't want it, I have a friend who might want it. Is it a shade I could see myself wearing? Yes, if it was in liquid lipstick form. I personally do not like lipsticks in this form they bleed they don't really last all day like yeah it, it's stained but that's a stain I also got all over my liners so that's fun I've been like wiping red off my liners all day so that's fun but that's it 
I'm going to go wash my face and do my nightly routine and call it a day. I will see you guys later. Thank you so much for watching. Um, if you like this video and you want to see me do more videos where I test products out, let me know. Um, I actually plan on going to Lush maybe this weekend and getting some henna hair dye because my roots need touching up. Um, I kind of need a color refresh anyway. You like my really ugly bun on top of my head? Like a giant bum bum. But yeah. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video and you want to see more, make sure you like it and give it a thumbs up. Same thing, right? Like, thumbs up. If you like this video and you want to see more, make sure you go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you are not already subscribed, make sure you hit that subscribe bell and the notification bell so you can know when I post all my future videos. I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching.